Come on, Facebook. Okay, that's it. Let's do this. Um, can't really remember where we were last time. Uh, I think I had just made it back to camp after we had got out of the circle tower. Um, I don't need that anymore. It was a one time thing. I think I had basically done everything I wanted to do here. Uh, one thing I want to have a quick look at. So I've given her that. I'm assuming I can check back with that later on. Located and uh, uh, six dashes, the plate. Um, yeah, I want to have a quick shift at the codex, is just in case there's anything interesting here. Generative Janitors, Lyrium. <coughs> and a little bit about Lyrium. Uh, more than half the wealth of Orzammar, which is the Dwarven capital, uh, comes from a single extremely substance. Lyrium, the Chantry believes it to be the waters of the Fade, mentioned in the Canticle of Therenides. Um The very stuff of creation itself, from whence the Maker fashioned the world. Only a handful of mining cast families hazard extracting the ore, finding veins in the stone quite literally by ear, for its for in its raw form, Lyrium sings, uh, and the discerning can hear the sound even through solid rock. Even though dwarves have a natural resistance, raw Lyrium is dangerous for all, but the most experienced of the mining cast to handle. Even for dwarves, exposure to unprocessed mineral can cause <coughs> deafness or memory loss. For humans and elves, Direct contact with Lurio Moore produces nausea, blistering of the skin and dementia. Mages cannot even approach unprocessed Lurium. Doing so is invariably fatal. <coughs> uh, oops, hold on. I just realised. Fuck something up. There we go, that's better. Oh, no, it's not. Fuck it again. There we go. Um, despite its danger, Lyrium is the single most valuable mineral currently known. In the Tevinter Imperium, it has been known to command a higher price than diamond. 
The dwarves sell very little of the processed mineral to the surface, giving the greater portion of what they mine to their own smiths who use it in, forging, in the forging of all truly superior dwarven weapons and armour. Uh, what processed lyrium is sold on the surface goes only to the Chantry, who strictly control the supply. From the Chantry it is dispensed both to the Templars, make use of it in tracking and fighting Maleficarum, and to the Circle. In the hands of the Circle, lyrium reaches its fullest potential, therefore Mary Craftsman transform it into an array of useful items from the practical such as magically held in stone for construction to the legendary silver armour of King Kaeland. When mixed into liquid and ingested, Lyrium allows mages to enter the Fade fully aware, unlike all others who reach it only while dreaming. Such potions can also be used to aid in the casting of especially taxing spells for a short time granting mage far greater power than he normally wields. Lorium has its cost, however, prolonged use becomes addictive, the cravings unbearable over time, Templars grow disoriented, incapable of distinguishing memory from present or dream from waking, they frequently become paranoid as their worst memories and nightmares haunt their waking hours. Mages have additionally been known to suffer physical mutation. The Magister Lords of the Tevinter Imperium were widely re reputed to have been so affected by the years of Lyrium use that they cannot be recognised by their own kin, nor even as creatures that had once been human. Okay, well the veil. I detest this notion that the veil is some manner of invisible curtain that separates the world of the living from the world of the spirits. Whether it be called the fade or the beyond is a matter of racial politics I refuse to indulge in at the moment. There is no this side and that side when it comes to the veil. One cannot think of it as a physical thing or a barrier or even a shimmering wall of holy light. Thank you very much for that image of perfection. Think of the veil instead as opening one's eyes. Before you opened them, you saw our world, as you see it now, static, solid, unchanging. Now that they are open, you see our world as the spirits see it, chaotic, ever-changing, a realm where the imagined and the remembered have as much substance as that which is real, more in fact. The spirit sees everything as defined by will and memory, and this is why they are so very lost when they cross the veil. In our world, imagination has no substance. <coughs> Objects exist independently of how we remember them or what emotions we associate with them. Mages alone possess the power to change the world with their minds, and perhaps this forms the nature of a demon's attraction to them, who can say? Regardless, the act of passing through the veil is much more about changing one's perceptions than physical transition. The veil is an idea, it is the act of transition itself, and it's only the fact that both living beings and spirits find the transition difficult that gives the veil any credence as a physical barrier at all. The Dryden's, the Chastened.
I was hoping more to like read about the mages and how the Templars came to sort of control them. Okay, maybe this helps. It's not uncommon for the neophyte to mistake apostates and Malificarum. It's only the same. Indeed, the Chantry has gone to great lengths over the centuries to establish that this is so. The truth, however, is that while an apostate is often a Malificar, <coughs> it need not be so. Malificar is a mage who employs forbidden knowledge, such as blood magic and summoning of demons, whereas an apostate is merely any mage does not fall under the auspices of the circle of magi and therefore the chantry they are hunted by the templars and quite often they will turn to forbidden knowledge in order to survive but it would be a lie to say that all apostates begin that way <coughs> historically apostates become such in one of two ways the real mages who have escaped from the circle or mages who were never part of it to begin with the latter category includes what we tend to refer to as hedge mages, those with magical ability out in the hinterlands who follow a different magical tradition than our own. Some of these hedge mages are not even aware of their nature. Under undeveloped, their abilities can express themselves in a variety of ways, which the hedge mage might attribute to faith or will, or to another being entirely, depending on its nature. Some of these traditions are passed down from generation to generation as with so-called witches of the chasing wilders or the shamans of the Avar barbarians no matter how a mage becomes an, becomes apostate the Chantry treats them alike Templars begin a systematic hunt to bring the apostate to justice in almost all cases justice is execution if there's some overriding reason the mage should live the right of tranquility is employed instead by the way of the circle of major, I believe the system is fair as irrelevant. It is what it is. That would be, I'm trying to learn a bit more about how this whole mage thing came to be. Because it seems, from what I can establish and what I've been able to pick up, that, um,. As soon as you exhibit any kind of uh, any kind of magical ability, you're taken away to that tower we were in, the circle tower. And basically trained to control your abilities. Very well. Otherwise, you may end up as a demon. Uh, I think I like Lilyana over him. I like when. Oh, yeah, yes. I'll start. Um, I otherwise you end up a demon. Or you can be possessed or whatever. Uh, <clears throat> but then it kind of, the way it was worded, like an apostate's a mage who escaped the tower, kind of seems like you're never really allowed to leave. But then they let one come with us, but I don't know if that's just because she's like quite high up or kind of she has special leave to come with us. So I don't really understand how it works. I'm not really sure. Fully, anyway. Uh, we are going... to... Uh, the Brasilia... Brickellian, Brazilian forest. 
I'm not there. I'm at camp. Okay, someone wants to fight us. This is fine. We will destroy them. Oh, dinner room. Cutscene. Sire, I have more news. Well, um, it's fucking keyboard yes. press. Well, it seems that the fighting has gone Enough. exactly as you... I would like to know what you intend to accomplish, Father. Should we not be fighting the Darkspawn instead of each other? The nobility should be brought into line and then the Darkspawn defeated. This is no true blight, Honora. Only Kalen's vanity demanded it be so. Beg pardon, sir. But blight or no, we may not have the manpower to face the Darkspawn suit. Kalen approached your legions for support, did he not? Never! Marek and I drove those bastards out! Not roll out the welcome for the now. We need help, Father. We cannot deal with this crisis alone. Ferelden will stand on its own. I will lead it through this, Anora. You must have faith in me. Did you kill Kalen? Kalen's death was his own doing. Mm hmm. <clears throat> Mm-hmm. Believe I believe in him. That wasn't combat. Okay. Um. Would you go in? I don't know, maybe maybe it is. Fuck are you. Adventure leader? Travels out here, eh? We even saw Dark Spawn on the way in. Where are you going? We're delivering a message to the Chantry in Denerim. You? What's the message? We about? saw a blood mage down near the Brazilian forest. We're off to tell the Chantry about him. Um. Thanks. We're heading out. Stay safe. I don't really care if they saw Blood Mage there. Am I supposed to know who it was they were talking about? Because I haven't the fucking foggiest idea who they were talking about. Stop right there, outsider. Dash. Dela should camp in this spot. I suggest you go elsewhere and quickly. Actually, I've been looking for the I Dash. find that hard to believe. What business could we Dalish possibly have with a group like yours? I am a Grey Warden. I wish to speak a to the leader. How do I know you're telling the truth? Whoops. Many people go about pretending no, that's to be true. Over there. Perhaps I shall let the keeper decide for himself. In the camp, I suggest you keep your hands to yourself and remember that our arrows are still trained on you. Follow me. Hmm. I see we have guests. Who are these strangers, Nithra? I have precious little patience and less time to spend on outsiders today. This one claims to be a Grey Warden and wishes to speak with the clan. I thought it best to leave the decision to you. That was wise of you. Masirinus Mithra, you may return to your post. Manuvenen Keeper. Now, allow me to introduce myself. I am Zaprian, the Keeper of this clan. Its guide and preserver of our ancient lore. And you are? My name is Arya. A pleasure to meet Man. you. From a Shemlin. Interesting. What might be your mission here? Have you come to spread news of the Blight? I had already sensed the corruption spreading in the South. The existence of the Blight is not news to me. I would have taken the clan north by now, had we the ability to move. Sadly, as you can see, we do not. 
Yes, it seems like you've had your own troubles. What are the odds? I imagine you are here regarding the treaty we signed centuries ago. Unfortunately, we may not be able to live up to the promise we made. This will require some explanation. Please, follow me. I like this guy. He doesn't fuck about. There they are. The clan came to the Brazilian forest one month ago, as is our custom when we enter this part of Ferelden. We are always wary of the dangers in the forest, but we did not expect the werewolves would be lying in wait for us. Werewolves. They ambushed us. And though we drove the beasts back, much damage was done. Many of our warriors lie dying as we speak, even with all our magic and healing skill. We will eventually be forced to slay our brethren to prevent them from becoming beasts. The Blight's evil must be stopped. But we are in no position to uphold our obligations. I am truly sorry. Why did these beasts attack you? They are savage and unrelenting. They need no reason to attack anyone. What is curious, however, is the ambush. We expect werewolves to be no more cunning than a rabid wolf. The ambush suggests a level of intelligence we've never seen before. There's no way the to affliction happen. is a curse that runs rampant in their blood, bringing great agony and then ultimately either death or a transformation into something monstrous. The only thing that could help them must come from the source of the curse itself. And that that would be no trivial task to retrieve. I'm good at non-trivial tasks. Within the Brazilian forest dwells a great wolf. We call him Witherfang. It was within him that the curse originated, and through his blood that it has been spread. If he is killed and his heart brought to me, perhaps I could destroy the curse. But this task has proven too dangerous for us. I sent some hunters into the forest a week ago, but they have not returned. I cannot risk any more of my clan. She said you could perhaps destroy the curse. There is no guarantee that this will work, as I suspect. But it's the only hope we have left. Back in two seconds. <laughs> Okay, she says there's no guarantee this will work. <coughs> if I help you, what will you give we me? We would assist with the blight, of course. And you would have our gratitude. Fucking spaghetti junction down here. I, will find this I must warn you that more than werewolves lurk in the Brazilian forest. It has a history full of carnage and murder, you see. Where there is so much death, the veil separating the spirit realm from our own becomes thin, allowing spirits to possess things, living or dead. But if you can indeed help, then I wish you luck. <laughs> What if I say I need some equipment? Then I suggest you see Master Verathorn. 
I will instruct him to put aside some supplies for you. The kind that the hunters use. Sweet. I should go. I must return to caring for my people. Creator's speed on your way. I must say, I... Uh... Hello? Hello. Uh, of course. I'm, I'm very sorry. It's just that we don't get many visitors. Uh, like you, I mean. Of your kind. It's never seen a human before. Oh, of course. It's just that they don't... I mean, you don't... Oh, I should start over. I am Kamen, a hunter apprentice. Though I wish I could become a real hunter. Why can't you? I shouldn't be talking about this to an outsider. You wouldn't understand. I suppose there's no harm in it. It's not like you can help me. I've been an apprentice for too long. To become a true hunter, I must bring back the pelt of the beast I killed myself. A boar or a wolf or something. Okay. I to hunt in the forest, but we're forbidden to enter because of the attack. But the real problem is Gaina. Gaina? Who's Gaina? She's my heart's desire. I have asked for her hand, but she cruelly refuses it. She will not bond with an apprentice, she says, and calls me a child. I am no child. If I was a hunter, I could prove it, but I cannot hunt and... And Gaina will never bond with me. I feel so helpless. I shouldn't have brought it up. Just leave me to my misery. Hashtag first world problems. There must be some way to solve your problem. You think I haven't thought about this? There's nothing I can do. What if I got a pill no, for you? No, I, I couldn't do that. I must kill the beast myself. It is my rite of passage to become a full hunter. You are right. I do want to marry Gaina before she marries someone else. So you would get a pelt for me? Why would you do that? <laughs> I wouldn't. I just wanted to see if you would agree. Because it suits me to any other reason. I am very grateful. I will pray to Andrul, the goddess of the hunt, for your success. Athras. I'm Darren Atitian, stranger. I am Athras. I hope the others have not been too harsh in their treatment of you. They've been a bit suspicious. I would be the same in their place. They have just been attacked, after all. It is not our intention to insult a Grey Warden. We are simply wrapped up in the plight of our hunters. It is easy to forget simple niceties at such a time. I understand you will search for the wolves in the Brazilian forest. I would join you, but Zathrian has forbidden me. You don't seem very happy about that. I'm happy about this situation. And I, least of all. But I shouldn't speak too much about this, especially with an outsider. I am sure you have little interest in my problems. Well, you have a quest marker above your head, so you must have something to offer me. <laughs> Little to no interest, actually. He's just passing the time. I... No. It is too strange to discuss something like that with you. Won't you reconsider? We would truly like to hear what has troubled you, sir. Very well. It's odd to talk so freely with a stranger, but... No, you won't listen Perhaps to me, you'll listen to Liliana. My wife, Denila, and I both fought the werewolves in the ambush. She was injured so gravely, the curse spread rapidly in her. Zathrian fought hard to ease her pain, but there was little he could do. And though he says that Denila is dead, he will not let me see her... her body. I am beginning to believe she became a werewolf. And that it is being kept from me, so I do not go chasing after her. If I could just know if Denila is alive, or what happened to her... Then I could be at peace. I will seek her out in the forest. It's not much, but I would be happy to give it to you in return for any news. 
Fine. As you say. Codex. Uh, right. Where is the vendor did? See a chest over there. Locked. Oh, Liliana might be able to pick the lock. Actually, I'm forgetting I don't have Zev with his crap lock we're picking. Dealer's gloves. Fine. Better gloves for Liliana. Uh, vendor dude. Oh, quest over here. Laura. <coughs> Who comes? Oh, I beg your pardon, stranger. I was so busy attending to the Hala, I did not hear your approach. Who are you? My name is Alora. I am the master herder in charge of caring for the Hala. Not as exciting as being a Grey Warden, but the Hala are vital to us. What is they are Hala? They the noble beasts that pull our Arabelle. What humans call land ships. They are our companions and our guides. I have seen your horses. The relationship is different, as is the purpose. We ride the Hala, but never with reins or a saddle. It is the Hala who decide where to lead us, and our privilege that they take our Aravel with them. In return, it's the herder's job to speak to the Hala and care for their needs. It's a Can bond of friendship, and not servitude. Weird-ass horse whispering motherfuckers. So why have you separated this one from the others? Let's cut to the chase. I fear she may have been bitten during the werewolf attack. I have tried speaking with her, but she is too agitated for me to understand. The curse would not affect her as it would us, but it would still be lethal. And it may prove contagious to the other Hala as well. I can find no wound on her, but if she's truly ill, then... Then I will have to put her out of her misery, for her sake as well as that of the others. Is there anything I, I can do know. to help? Do you have any skills that might help her? If you do, I would be grateful. Uh, pretend to examine the Hala. Survival, examine the Hala. And? What do you think? I truly I'm cannot tell. Attempted it regardless. Survival, try to calm the Hala. No. No, I'm sorry. She isn't calming any more around you than she is for me. Damn. I'm sorry, I tried my best. It was kind of you to try. Uh, I will watch her for a while longer and see if her condition changes. I'll come back later. I'm grateful for your <coughs> assistance, friend. Or when I have someone with survival skill. Right, do we have... Oh, there's another quest near the house. Never seen... What are you doing? You've warped the wood completely. Did you leave it out in the rain? No, Master Ferrothorn. I, uh... I think I just used too much heat. You're not smelting ore like a Durgenlin. This is living wood. It requires patience and delicate hands, not more heat. My actions bring me sorrow, Master Verathorn. And so they should. Truly the art will be lost to us forever at this rate. Throw away your dead wood and start anew, and I shall speak to our guest. Now then, please forgive my distraction, stranger. Is there something that you need? Uh... Told you could supply me yes, with equipment. Yes, the keeper sent word that you might ask me for such. I took the liberty of assembling some goods that our hunters use. There is a large chest by the Araville where I put everything we could spare. Feel free to sort through it and take whatever you need. 
better be some fucking good stuff in there. I, I like am no merchant, here. but let us trade. Perhaps there's something here which will be of value to you. Uh, health pulvers, injured cat. I can really roll it with. Nah, I don't really care about it. So, what's his quest? What do you wish? What is that? I do it's my responsibility to learn what I can of the ancient elven arts of shaping wood and ore. In truth, we Dalish know little of the art compared to what we once did. And even what we know has taken us many lifetimes to achieve. There is wood that, if treated properly, is as hard as steel. Okay, I see what we're getting out here. It grows only in this forest. Ironbark. The keeper has forbidden us from entering the forest to collect the wood. This means I cannot make our finest crafts for years to come. I would be hesitant to ask it of you, but if you should come across iron bark, I suppose there would be no harm in gathering some. It is blue and very distinctive. You can only harvest the bark which has fallen off the tree from age. Now, if you find some, bring it to me, and I will craft it for you. What kind of item would you make? I excel in making blades from the iron bark, or, or perhaps a breastplate, provided there's enough wood, that is. Very well. That would please me. So long as our hunters come first. I should go. Darth Shiro. May the creators visit fortune upon you. I didn't want to fucking battle you. Uh it is begun. Ooh, Dalish boots. Um Less f it has the same armor and less fatigue than my boots. Do I have leather boots on? No chainmail boots. Sweet. Uh, where was that fucking... Ah. Supplies are pretty crap. Right. Done everything. Sorry, forest. We are going this way. Off to fight some fucking werewolves. Let's just get this. Go deck. I shall do it. Very well. Into the forest we go. They say the veil is thin here, and all manner of strange things may be seen. Uh, what's coming for us? Oh, that's a werewolf. Now, here's the question. Do they pass... ...a physical check? No, they do not. I'm liking the glow coming off my 
Wait, oh, I found this. Okay, we didn't take too much damage there. I shall do it. It shall be done. Very well. Onward. Uh, you need me, I guess. The werewolves came from up there, so let's go this way and see what's down here. The logic being that where the werewolves came from is possibly where we want to be going. Oh, do I want to fuck with that? Do I want to fuck with that? As you said. Yeah, I want to fuck with that. Oh, yeah. Fuck your physical resistance, bitch. If that's better than Alistair's, hopefully it's better than Alistair's. Eight forty. It's like a high critical chance. Plus point six percent. Yeah, the effects are just better. I can give it to someone else. Oh, more werewolves. Swift run. Oh, we can talk. The watch wolves have spoken truly, my brothers and sisters. Werewolves that can talk. The Dalys and the human of all things do repay us for our attack to put us in our place. What bitter irony. You speak. I thought werewolves were savage beasts. We are beasts, but we are no longer simple and mindless. Let that thought chill your spine. You speak to Swift Runner. I lead my cursed brothers and sisters. Turn back now. Go back to the Dalish and tell them that you have failed. Tell them we will gladly watch them suffer the same curse. We have suffered for too long. We will watch them pay. Pay for what? You send us if you hate the Dalish again. Oh, that we do. How dare they send you here against us? Turn and leave while you still have the chance. It's funny that you think you can threaten me, but I was kind of hoping for some, um, Elaboration on why you hate the Dalish so much. We are not afraid of you. Hey, come, brothers and sisters. We fight. Come on, bitch. Don't. has eyes of its own, and it shall deal with you. You have been warned. <laughs> that fight lasted long. Right. Andras this what? Did I walk right past this? Andras this grace. Oh Liliana likes these, doesn't she? Yes, yeah, she does. Let's give it to her right now. Oh, how dear of you. Thank Yeah, you're welcome. Hey, right, I kinda don't want to go like 
gonna move. Really? I must maintain. I kind of don't want to just. Go straight here because I'm pretty sure there's other quests in the forest that I can do. That's a lot of blood. Well, let's see. Let's see if we can. Um, Selling forest. I'm assuming we'll find that crap on the way. There was other stuff though. Um, no, that's not what I'm looking for. Mage's Collective. Find and activate four mystical sites of power located in the Brazilian forest. Deep roads down them. Right, you know what? Fuck it. I don't care which direction I'm going in. Can I walk over that tree now? Let's just head in a direction. And we'll see what we come up with. Also, why am I, I don't know why I made my guy a trap maker for shit. What does that take me? Yeah, it takes me back to camp. So I've just went in a circle, basically. Oops. Now let's head straight then. I love that one just has the heels built into our default tactic. Makes life much easier. Magic and willpower. Ooh. All we really care about as far as healing goes. Uh, do we want to give her some elemental damage just in case it's useful at some stage? I guess we'll level up the main mage class thing. Yet. Wow. 
behind this fucker. Right, then. No, no, no. Sweet. Suck an egg over. I love when it does the finishing moves. What's coming for me here? Oh, there's a quest marker over there. What the fuck is that? Hi, what's that? I never noticed that before. Ah, I rock. Excellent. Painted Skyball gift. No more gifts. I'm gonna guess the. You said to me something before you, it gives you an uneasy feeling. It has begun. Okay, that was one of the mystic sites of power I had to activate. There it is. Don't walk across there. I'm really turned around now. Hold on. Okay, I don't want to be going that way. I want to be turning back and going this way. Come at me, werewolves. Uh, appear to be at a fork in the road. Looks like a waterfall. Oh, saving game. Oh, I just fucking... I just fucking shit my pants, man. Man, there's more of these fuckers down here, man. I can see them. Look, here's one. We must not exhaust. There's not two over there. What the fuck? Our supplies. Passes are cooking this thing's check. Big ass fucking tree up there. Grand Oak clearing. Oh, orange enemy, Grand Oak. Excellent. Oh, go. We can maybe talk to it. What manner of beast be thee that comes before this elder tree? Is he gonna rhyme the whole time? Can't you see me? I'm a human. Ah, yes. I remember thy kind. So brief of life and all but blind. 
to the peril you cause, the lives you take, such chaos is sown within thy wake. Allow me a moment to welcome thee. I am called the Grand Oak. Sometimes the Elder Tree. Oh, cool as fuck, man. The world is certainly full of marvelous, unexpected creations. Each day we see something that we never thought possible. Wow. And unless thou thinkst it far too soon, might I ask of thee <laughs> a boon? What I have image? but one desire <coughs> to solve a matter very dire. As I slept one early morn, a thief did come and steal. An He's officially my favorite character. I kill Raymond Tree. <laughs> and you want it back? All I take it. I have is my being, my seed. Without it, I am alone indeed. I cannot go and seek it out, yet I shall die if left without. <laughs> Very well, I will help you. Go to the east to find this man. I shall await do what thou can. Well, maybe tell your buddies not shall to fucking die. attack me, man. Don't give them the advantage! <laughs> Uh, east, which is back where we came, possibly. Oops. Oh my! Fucking trees everywhere. Oh my god! Another one. This one's just, just a white bar. I can't even deck the white bar ones. <laughs> Fucking psycho trees. The camp set appears remarkably intact. The tents and bedrooms are covered with leaves, but are dry and whole. This forest is fucking weird, man. Continue. Fire pit smokes and possesses embers enough to build a small flame. No sign of any inhabitants. This is strange. The werewolves would not use such a camp, would they? Whoever this belongs to must be nearby. Probably right, keep an eye out. You get no hint of danger, though it strikes you odd that the camp is abandoned. Perhaps searching the camp will give more clues to its nature. You look inside the tent and surprised by how dry and cosy it feels. It's clean but empty. What a pleasant place to rest. The your elven head. hunters didn't set this up. How strange. And yet it all just seems so friendly. I want to do nothing but remain. I can't leave yet. We need to stay out. It takes all your strength to step back from the tent. It waves away. This is a sloth demon. Young there is the fire pit has been untended for several hours at most. The embers draw you in almost hypnotizing you. The light and the fire, they are so pretty. The flickering, glowing warmth, comfort. I wish I could just lie here and Can you feel the power here? What is this?
examine the bedroll. It's clean and warm. You feel like you haven't slept in ages. It's nice to cut up and sleep. I feel magic here. Draining my strength. We must leave. And soon. I feel it too. We need to stay awake. Unable to resist. <laughs> Oh, I'm, I appear to just be win. Um. Well done, one. With the shield destroyed, the fog seemed to lift. The camp that was here is ancient, and the remnants of the shield victims all lie as if sleeping still. How long has that spirit lingered there, and how many has it preyed upon? I shudder to think of it. Well done, one. Ah, um, the rest of my guys. Fucking got injury. Fucking. Sharma. That probably do for Liliana, I think. Get help for Mr. String. What's in help for us? Take a written from here. I can't go any further that way, so has to be back the way I came. Can we go this way? Without being mauled by a million trees? Quite a bit of health. Not too bad though. What's this? South exit to East Forest. Let's see where it takes us. The tree did say that it was in the east. East Brazilian Forest. Mm. 
It is begun. Fucking every time this bastard trees get me. I'm going to put a indomitable on. The fuck is that? Forest barrier. Yeah, I'm not walking in that. That's this. There's nothing good that's gonna come of me walking straight into that fucking thing. Look at all the trees. Look at the fucking trees waiting there. She used the wrong fucking ability. something oh dear oh dear not a werewolf and not a spirit even what are the woods coming to are you the thief who took the grand old take on I did and mayhap I didn't have you come to claim it back oh, what fun but we are getting ahead of ourselves already Ask a question and you'll get a question, but give an answer and you'll receive the same. Is this the dude oh, from the fucking so Holy Grail? What is your favourite colour? You want me to answer the Wouldn't question? I have to ask you a question first. Isn't that a question? Would you know a question if it was asked? Are you mocking me? I don't me? know. Are you mocking me? I see what's happening here. Stop answering my... Oh, I can't answer Those that. are the rules. A question for a question, an answer for an answer. Were you not listening? Be careful, Grey Warden. This is no ordinary man. He is a mage. Driven mad, perhaps, but still powerful. No fair bringing mages <coughs> to a guessing game. Will you play by the rules or not? Then would you like I to think ask it is question? your turn to ask, is it not? What can you tell me about the forest? Spirits, that's the problem of this forest. And all the curses and the angry wolfmen who howl enough to drive you to madness. And you yell at them, but they run and hide deep within the center of the forest, and the trees protect them. There's a way to fool the trees, of course. Trees are thick, wooden things, after all. Easily fooled, if you know how. And you know how, don't you? Oh my, no, that's quite a question. I think that answer deserves something a little extra first, don't you? I stole something from an oak tree some time ago, and it won't stop pestering me for it back. Would you be so good as to turn it into firewood or something equally dead? Are you talking about the Raiming Oak? You know of it? Good, that makes this much easier. Yes, that's the one. I'm not going to kill some oak tree because you asked it's me to. It's up to you. Yes, indeedy. Your choice. Time to move on now. Do you want to ask me another question? May I? Oh, yes, I think I might. Now, what shall be the first? 
Oh, yes. What is your name? Red, no, blue. You may call me uh, So you claim they sent you, didn't they? But you're too tricky, and you're trying to fool me. Well, I'm on to you, just so you know. But it is your turn to ask now. Ask. Ask away, I dare you. Who are you? Who am I? Why do you want to know? Did they <coughs> send you? Did they tell you to ask? That's a lot of questions. You better have some answers. Ah, damnation! Caught their ah. own words. <laughs> oh. My you great to pretend to be an innocent stranger with a head full of fluff and nothing. I'm trickier than I look. <laughs> I survive still, and the trees, they leave me be. <laughs> I've won. They will never find me. Never. I found you. So you did. But I'm watching you. If they sense you, I'll know. But that's all I have to say about that. An answer for an answer. There you go. Do you want to ask May me? I? Oh, yes, I think I might. Hmm. Where were you born? Let's get going for a while. <laughs> I was born on the turn of Hyla. Hmm. So you say, fiendishly clever of you to maintain this facade for so long, but I will see through it yet. Mark my words. But it is your turn to ask now. Ask. Ask away, I dare you. I'll fucking ask. Do you live in the stump? Yes, I live here, and it's not as bad as you think. Where else to go, eh? I must stay away from them. They are out there and looking. They will take your secrets, oh yes, all of them, and leave you empty. But that's all I have to say about that. An answer for an answer. There you go. Don't ask me that question. I? Oh, yes, I think I might. Let's see. Do you have a knowledge of the arcane arts? No, of course oh, not. Well, that's disappointing. But wait. What if you are lying? Ah, you thought to scamper away without suspicion, did you? Well, I'm on to you. But it is your turn to ask now. Ask. Ask away, I dare you. Do you have anything Let's to trade? See. I'll trade you an acorn, a helmet I found, or a book I finished reading years ago, provided you have something interesting in return. What to trade oh. for the acorn? And what do you have to trade for the acorn? I found some oh, things yes. in the forest. Many things are buried deep here. Treasures. <laughs> How about the silver ring hey? I found? I once had a ring like that. This one's shiny still. Yes, I'll take it. Give me that. There. Now that's done. What else have you got on your agenda, hmm? Where should oh, you go? I see. You're going to report to them now, are you? Fine. Goodbye. And he ran away. No, oh, no, he didn't. He's still there. I can talk to the tree stump. Hold on, you. That's private property. That's an old man's home, that is. Keep out. Keep out. Try to the small cave. <laughs> Let's reach into the cubby hole. Do you find something to grab onto it? You're a robber, is what you are. They sent you, didn't they? Well, I'll show you. They won't get away with this. Mm hmm. So he's a blood mage. Oh. He passed. Him. He was I'm gonna heal me no. Heal me. Oh, 
I don't come over that time. Check that finishing move out. He must have um must have cast a spell to boost his physical resistance. So did we finish with this? Oh wow, still leveled up. Uh, let's put some <coughs> points in the constitution. Okay, so we can go back to the tree now. Good, more dark swan. Can see that shit. I, um, oh fuck, he just done it too. Holy fuck! It shall be done. Never seen that in my fucking life before. Is there a pure ninja finishing move? What do you need? Oops. done anything to stop these werewolves at all. The air seems a natural core of the central runs of warding are carved on the surface. Stop the walls. Come on, big demon. Devouring scale and revenant. Let's go see what you are, eh buddy? Fucking You just fucking one shot me. He actually just one shot me. <laughs> Fuck. Oh no way man. <sighs> Okay, it's fine, I'm not overly far away from where I was. I need to fight these trees again.
Okay, so we head east. Fight the rest of these trees. I can't believe how much that thing just fucking wrecked me, man. We won't be disturbing that fucking grave again, that's for sure. Through this, um, mayhap I did, and mayhap I didn't. Have you come to claim it back? Oh, uh, what? Uh, rattle through this dialogue. Getting ahead of ourselves Rested. already. Ask a question, and you'll get <coughs> a question, but give an answer, and you'll receive the same. Oh, I do so love to trade. Wouldn't I have to ask you a question first? Would you know a question if it was asked? No! That is not a question. <clears throat> and if it be an answer, it be an answer to a question I've not asked. Have you no sense for the rules? <coughs> he Grey Warden. He's no ordinary man. He is a mage. Driven mad, perhaps, but still powerful. No fair bringing mages to a guessing game. <coughs> rules or not. I think it is your turn to ask, is it not? Do you have anything Let's to see. trade? I'll trade you an acorn, a helmet I found, or a book I finished reading years ago, provided you have something interesting in return. I want to oh. trade for the acorn. And what do you have to trade for the acorn? Uh. I found some things in the forest. Many things are buried deep here. Treasures. <laughs> How about the silver ring I found? Eh? I once had a ring like that. This one's shiny still. Yes, I'll take it. Give me that. There. Now that's done. What else have you got on your agenda? Hmm? There she goes. Oh, I see. You're going to report to them now, are you? Fine. Goodbye. Can't really be bothered fighting the dude again. Not really doing any harm. Oops. Right away. He does summon demons, right, but do we really care? Nah, I don't really care. See you, pal. We'll go around this way, kill these ogres. Stop being awesome. Never ever stop being awesome.
As you say. Very well. save it here and I'm not going to disturb this grave this time obviously I'm instead going to simply keep walking Pretty decent finishing move on that bear as well. It's pretty cool. Okay, we're kind of back towards here. Uh, I don't see much choice. Be careful now! Quest marker up here. That's the um That's the dude's fucking wife, isn't it? Please help listen. I am not the mindless beast I appear to be. What happened to you? I am cursed. Turned into this creature. Curse it. it burns in me. I fled into the forest. The werewolves, they took me in, but I had to return. I had to. Careful. These werewolves might have laid a trap for us or something. You never know. You are human. I am. I was once an elf, one of the Dalish folk. I to love my clan. Your keeper is a threaten. The keeper sent you? Then you seek with a fang. I seek with a fang. I do. Have you seen him? I have, but... <laughs> It is not what you think, but there is no time to explain. You must listen. My name is Delilah. My husband, he is called Athras. Please, you must bring him a message. Oh, the poor woman, she's in such pain. The staff I wear. Bring it to him. 
Tell him I love him. Tell him I am dead and with the gods. I beg you. But you're not I dead. will be soon enough. I just want him to be at peace. It's actually quite difficult to watch. I need answers first, please, you must help me. I will tell you what I know. I found that difficult when I'm an asshole. And no, skin you. Uh, where does that lead? Somewhere new. Let's go this way. <coughs> Northwest forest. Has begun. May as well. We must not exhaust every fucking time that stupid Stop fucker supply. tree gets me. directions to go in here. Oh, we can... Right, okay, we're back in the... Didn't realise we were back in the old place. And go back to this oak. Hey, buddy. My acorn is still gone, so I pray to thee. Hast thou any news for me? Is this the acorn you seek? My joy soars to new heights indeed. I, I am fucking love that raven tree. With my seed. As I promised, here it be. I hope its magic pleases thee. Keep this branch of mine with thee and pass throughout the forest free. I wish thee well, my mortal friend. Thou brought my sadness to an end. May the sunlight find you. Thy days be long, thy winters kind, and thy roots be strong. Cheers, buddy. What do you give us?
Oak branch. What's the staff? Uh, should have got stuff for Lillian as well. Ooh, okay, there it is. No, that won't work. No, that won't work. No, that won't work. Don't know why she wants them. On the way, uh, fuck knows. Must be for someone. Oh well. Uh, what time is it? Half past eleven. Uh, let's. Should we wander further? North exit to East Forest. South exit to East Forest. That goes back to the camp. Try to see. Where else we can go? We need to get to the centre of the forest because that's where the werewolves are. I kind of want to. I, I need to. I need to stop soon because I, I've got some stuff to do before I go to bed. Um, but I kind of want to get to a place where I'm. At where I need to be. Okay, yeah, so we didn't explore all here. I'm gonna go, yeah. To that, it looks like it's to possibly towards the centre. Um, yeah. I kinda wanna get a place where when I pick this up next time, I can just dive right into where we need to be. Oh, wait, that's. That forest barrier is. I'm gonna save this before I try and do anything with this because it might kill me instantly. And up branch. Ah, aha, I see. Swift running again. The forest has not been vigilant enough. Still, you can't. So the trees were protecting them. You are stronger than we could have anticipated. The Dalish chose well, but you do not belong here, outsider. Leave this place. <sighs> Why won't you let me try to settle this dispute? You are sent by the treacherous Dalish to kill Witherfang. I will not stand by and allow that to happen. Why do you call the Dalish treacherous? You attack them. Deserve no less. Elaborate. You are an intruder in our home. You come to kill, as all your kind do. We have learned this lesson well. Here, Witherfang protects us. Here, we learn our names and our beloved. We will defend Witherfang and this place with our <coughs> lives. Man, use your words. Yeah. Uh, it's <laughs> twice he's got away from me.
Um, uh, uh, hello. I am not disturbing that fucking gravestone. No fucking way. Next demon statue. Who, would, who wants an onyx demon statue? I am ready. Morgan, maybe. We are invaded. Intruders have deceived their way into the forest heart. Fall back to the ruins. Protect the lady. They're still like talking and then fucking running away, don't they? Punk ass bitches. Who's the lady? Right. So we're moving into the ruins now. Ruins upper level. Oh, fuck. I think I remember what's about to happen here. Is this an elven place? Did the elves live underground just like the dwarves? Okay, maybe not yet. That wall looks fake. Nice call. Stuff you find in this game is super garbage. It's like very occasionally useful. Oops, I thought I'd like to loot him. Rubble. Blade of the werewolves. Click can't unlock. Oh man, look at this ah, uh, look at those webs. Ah, uh, what's that? Oh man, so I have to get me the heebie jeebies. Oh man, it's so disgusting. Fuck 
cough. There isn't any fucking. Uh, <clears throat> but we're coming up. Uh, let's go master combat train. Oh fuck, I just arsed that right up. Uh, no point in the straight thing. Um, deadly strike. Rogue makes a swift strike. At a vulnerable area on the target, dealing normal damage, we're getting bonus for to armor penetration. Let me know where the flank can go. Backstab is easier to achieve. Let's give her stealth. Ah, oh, this place is just so horrible, man. Look at all these fucking holes in the wall and everything. Right, I think, I think I've reached about all I can do tonight. Um, I don't want to really go into any deeper than this because I'll end up playing for the next two hours and not doing the stuff I'm supposed to do, so um, yeah, I'm, I'm definitely calling it a night there. Uh, I'm should be back tomorrow um, playing football after work, so I'll be home a bit later, provided I'm not totally shattered, I'll be on tomorrow, um, just stay tuned to Twitter and Facebook and if I'm going to be streaming I'll, I'll, I'll give some warning, um, but yeah, thanks for, for joining, I will uh, catch you guys later.